Have you found that your PC keeps crashing? You built a new gaming PC, much like the one behind me, and yet, whenever you go to play games, it keeps crashing. Blue screening, the games crash, maybe the PC resets completely. It could be one possible thing that's causing it. A silly mistake that you've made, or a basic error, that if you're new to PC building and PC gaming, you might not realise you've done. I want to demonstrate this with a quick story about how it happened to someone I know. So I built a gaming PC for a friend, I stress tested it, and I made sure everything was working nicely, and then I sent it home with him. And then the day after, when he tried to play games, it kept crashing. It kept just resetting whenever he was playing The Last of Us or PUBG, which is an obvious problem and a frustrating one. Back and forth, tech support from me. We basically didn't get anywhere. This was very odd because I'd stress tested it beforehand. I'd updated the BIOS. I'd updated the drivers. I'd made sure everything would work as smoothly as possible. But he'd made one silly mistake, which you might be making too and not really realize it, especially if you're new to PC gaming or this is your first PC. So I want to demonstrate it here with this. Because basically what you can see here is that I've got the HDMI cable from the monitor plugged into the motherboard rather than the graphics card. That is the mistake that he was making as well. Now, some CPUs, like the one in this system, the AMD 9800X3D, have a built-in GPU in them, so it has some processing possible in there. It helps support gaming, and it means that you can run games, so you can see the finals is running there, but this is not the best way to do it. It impacts performance negatively and can cause problems. Apparently, sometimes those problems are so bad that it causes the system to crash entirely. Switching that cable from the motherboard to the graphics card was something that he did, and now the system runs fine and he can play those games happily without any issues. Now, I didn't realize that that would cause that problem. I know that if you do it in the motherboard, you're probably not going to get as good FPS and it can lead to other issues, but I've never heard of it causing crashes like that. So it's one simple mistake that people might be making that I just wanted to point out. Now, there are plenty of other reasons your system might crash it could be overheating for example i've got separate videos on that talking about how to work out whether your cpu is running too hot whether your system's thermal throttling it could be drivers there's been issues with nvidia's drivers that's causing the screen on the monitor to go black that's another separate problem there's lots of different things that you might need to troubleshoot on a gaming pc that could be causing issues but if you've got your monitor plugged into the motherboard, change it immediately. Now, I'll link to other videos in the description that might help you troubleshoot if that's not your problem. But I thought this quick video might help somebody. So thanks very much for watching. You've made it right to the end of the video, you brilliant legend you. If you've enjoyed it, click that subscribe button, give me a thumbs up, and drop me a comment down below if you've got any questions. If you really enjoyed it, consider joining the channel and see the benefits of doing so. Check out these other videos. You might well find them interesting or useful. And most importantly, have a great life.